Manchester Science Festival is a fantastic celebration of science, technology, engineering and maths. We have hundreds of events taking place over nine days in October half term for the whole family. We've got events for adults, events for the under fives, events for the hundred year old plus. We have workshop shows, comedy, theatre, walks, talks, debates happening in loads of different venues. We've got museums, galleries, train stations, markets, you name it. And it's a really exciting time. We want to try and get people excited and inspired by science, realise how relevant it is to their lives. is called Super Case Sonic Boob and it's a recreation of a massive neutrino detector in Japan. So we've got some visual illusions where we kind of apply them to the body so we stretch people's fingers or swap their hands from left to their right. We're talking just about different shapes of different people, different animals' brains. So comparing to so a person's brain to different animals' brains. We're trying to do a shape looking in the mirror and not looking down and it's really hard. The families really enjoy the phone timeline uh, where they can ring each other and, and grandparents enjoy seeing phones that they remember from when they were young. Well, I think it's important, especially for deaf kids, to see um, science going on because it's part of life. I mean, you know, they've come here, they've enjoyed themselves today and they've had a laugh with um, Audrey and Gary doing their characters, but they've also, you know, through enjoying themselves, learned something important. I like the exploded pop bottles. I liked it when um, the bottle went up in the air and it looked like it was a firework. The kids enjoyed it and the adults enjoyed it as well because it was something new for me as well. Science busking is basically um, short interactive demonstrations about lots of different kind of phenomena that happen in science. Um, loads of them are kind of made from household items like missing the straw oboes, the secret sounds of the oven shelf and so on. The art installation that we have here as well as uh, some of the workshops is just an example of some of the ways that high energy and art uh, can collide at the Manchester Science Festival. It does give a pretty cool idea about what could be happening at the most fundamental level of our universe. Yeah, I'm a college student from Shanghai University of Engineering Science. And you know, these are our designers from the uh, from college and we bring it from Shanghai to Manchester for the relationship between our two cities. So we're doing a series of walks on a number of different science related themes in Manchester. Because Manchester has been a great city of scientific invention, so it's the perfect city to do walks like this. So in this workshop we're doing the um, trash and We're doing plastic bonding, so we're making like jewellery out of carry bags and stuff. Well we've got a black plastic bag and we've put the iron on it to make it smaller. I made this before, and I made it out of zip, lace, a button, and a belt. Manchester Science Festival is brilliant. It seems like everyone's up for an adventure. I've been serving them some very weird, unusual, and slightly disturbing food, and everyone's tried it. Yeah. It's brilliant, I've had a great time. <laughs>